Yep. So there you go. Making a noise, eh? Yep. Right, to convert 0 0.97 degrees lagging to the number of degrees, so you can use it in your phaser diagram, enter inverse or shift cos 0.97 equals 37.814 degrees. 37 814 degrees. Again, to convert 0.85 lagging in the calculator, enter inverse cos 0.85 equals 31.788 degrees. 31.788 degrees and 0.8 shift. Shift cos 0.8 equals 36.8698. We need to round that number up, which turns that into a 10, which is going to turn that into a 7. So 36.87 36 degrees for blue. Yep. Right, now we need to construct a phaser diagram and put voltages on here. My red voltage will be out here. 120 degrees lagging behind that will be my white voltage. 120 degrees around here, my white voltage. And another 120 degrees behind there. Blue voltage. Voltage phases. Calculations earlier showed that the current in the red was lagging by 37.81 degrees. Lagging will be down this way, so anti clockwise. Thirty-seven thirty-seven point eight one degrees, twenty, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, eight one degrees. And it will be one hundred and twenty-five long, one millimeter to the amp. That's not going to fit on our page, so we'll go for half scale. Half of 125 is 62.5, so red current, 62.5. It is 125 amps. Behind the blue phase, voltage is... 31.788 degrees. Thirty one point seven eight eight. Thirty one thirty one point seven eight eight. It's one hundred and forty seven long. I'm using half. Blue phase, blue current is lagging by 36.87 degrees. So measuring from the blue voltage, 36.87, 35, 36, 37, 36.87, blue voltage at 215, half scale, 107.5, 100, 105, 106, 107.5, 
blue current. Okay, having constructed our phasor diagram showing currents, we need to solve the three phasor currents and we pick on any two. We're going to solve uh, the red in relation to the blue. So we take the red phasor and transfer it to the top of the blue. So same direction, same length. <coughs> and then where the two cross is our resultant. We have to simplify everything. And the way to simplify it is to put to give them online assessment. Yes. So maybe it could be multiple choice, it can be multiple yeah. choice, it's difficult. Yeah. That's not the problem. So That's where they cross. But we need, we need to sit there That's the resultant. So now I've used the red phase, I've used the blue phase, this is my result. Now I need to resolve the resultant of those two and my white phase. <coughs> So transfer this one. <coughs> That's transferring that line from there to there. Now I need to transfer this line from here to there. Where the two meet is our neutral current. Neutral. It measures Twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, twenty-nine times two because we're using a half scale. Fifty-eight. So fifty-eight. Uh, fifty-eight amps neutral current. That's the answer.